so what we're going to do now is work on the second derivative uh, in parametric form. So what we want here is d squared y dx squared, which literally means uh, the derivative with respect to x of dy uh, dx, right? Uh, we're going to do that using the dy dx that we've already found using dy dt over dx dt, right? So I want to walk you through why the formula uh, is what it is, and then we'll write it down, and it is kind of worth memorizing. It's one of those formulae. Uh, finding d squared y dx squared in parametric is something you just want to memorize for your AP, uh, but it makes more sense if we walk through why it is what it is. So, uh, so let's go ahead down here and walk through this. So we know that this is d dx of dy dx, but we already said here that I could call my dy dx dy dt over dx dt, right? So that's that's what we said that this thing could be. So the trick is that when we're doing parametrics, we rarely, if ever, are actually deriving with respect to x, right? So what we really want here is a dt. So the easiest way uh, to get a dt here is essentially to rewrite this so that the entire, uh, essentially so that what's happening is that this entire thing is multiplied by a 1 over dt and a 1 over dt. I'm allowed to do that because uh, it's essentially uh, 1, because it's, one over something and then divided by the exact same quantity. So if I rewrite this a little bit, if I put these dt's at the front, what I get is d dt, which means the derivative with respect to t, of this thing that I've got in red here, right, of this thing, which was my dy dt over dx dt. And then on the bottom, I get this dx over dt. So I get this dx over dt. So essentially the formula that we end up with is find the derivative of the first derivative that you took, right? So this first derivative you already found, and then divide it by the derivative of x with respect to t. So uh, again, essentially what you're doing is you're deriving with respect to t the derivative you already found, right? And then you're dividing by the derivative with respect to t uh, of x, right? So essentially to find my d squared y, dx squared, I'm going to derive with respect to t of whatever my dy dx was, right? The dy dx that you already found. And then you're going to divide it by your dx dt, right? Uh, and again, another way to write that dx dt is a y, uh, I'm sorry, an x prime of t, 